Welcome to this video tutorial, Calculating Zero and Span Error. Calculating Zero and Span Error requires the transmitter's static transfer equation in standard form. The static transfer equation shown is from a Rousemount 1151 after an as-found calibration test. Finding the zero error starts with determining the transmitter's output current when the ideal lower range value input pressure is applied to the transmitter's input. For the Rosemount 1151 tested, this was minus 200 millimeters of water column pressure. The output current for this input is 6.133 milliamps, when ideally, it should be four. The zero error is the calculated output current at the ideal lower range value input pressure minus the ideal output current of four milliamps. In this case, it's 6.133 milliamps minus four milliamps. Therefore, the zero error for this transmitter is 2.133 milliamps. The span error is the actual input span minus the ideal input span, all divided by the ideal input span and multiplied by 100%. In this case, it's 26%. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video.